<laughs> they're not coffee mugs, they're tea. It doesn't matter. This is why, Still, if they were coffee, darn straight I would have kept them. But, I love you enough to give you a tea set. <laughs> my family calls it my superpower. It's my ability to see value in things that other people might overlook. Sometimes I go picking with my boyfriend, sometimes it's my best friend Sue, and sometimes it's my kids. But at the end of the day, it's all about having fun and hopefully just maybe making a profit. All right. All right, so obviously we did not do terribly well at the community aid. Uh, we are now moving on to the Goodwill. Okay, so we've got another ashtray here, it looks like. I'm like in love with this. It is a puppy with a fire hydrant. It is putting out the cigarettes. Um, <laughs> it's such a cute theme. I don't see any damage to it. So we're gonna grab the puppy. The price is $5, which is a little steep, but I think we'll do okay with that. The other thing I noticed were these glasses. They're very heavy. Oh, you know what? Never mind. Check that out. Got like a horrible chunk out of it. So never mind. Never mind glasses. Oh, this is neat. It's like a puppet. Fish River Crafts from Maine. That's pretty neat. Got this. Lefton. Lefton made in Italy? Huh. Usually Lefton is Japanese? It's got some chipping. That doesn't really strike me as Italian either. It doesn't have the Italian detail. It looks Japanese. We're gonna leave that there. Hmm. Oh my gosh, look at all these dog figurines. Somebody's puppy collection. Oh my god. <laughs> $10. Do we need this for $10? Do we need all of them for $30? I feel like we at least need these puppies. And then, do we need the rest of them? That is the, that is the real question. I mean, come on. All right, let's see what we have in here. That red dog in there looks good. That red one in the corner. I mean, I'm, I'm seeing mostly Japanese dogs. Most of these are Japanese. There's no like, German porcelain, and I can actually see that through the tape because I'm pretty good at spotting them. Um, yeah, there's no real, I mean, that one might be English. I like that one with the newspaper. I don't know if I like them $10 worth. You know what? We'll grab these too. If this one is still here next week. We'll grab that one. I'm spending $20 on ceramic dogs. Why not? If they were cats, I'd do the same thing. I'd probably buy all three if they were cats, let's be honest. All right, let's swing down this way real quick. Ma'am, I would like to check your cart, please. And see yeah, what as long you as you're have. not asking for my receipt. <laughs> <laughs> well, this I just grabbed. This was a big thing in the mid-century. Here, naturally, I opened it up because you I have wanted to. to make sure it was what I thought it was. It's a card box. Ah. And they would keep these for bridge parties. <laughs> it would be out on the coffee table. Nice old piece. Um. Now, this is just a very pretty little Asian, uh, this is often called cafe ware. Very nice standard 
Asian blue. And it's a dollar. Like that. This, I thought somebody might oh my like. Oh gosh. He's the looking light, at you. Delightful. You know he can he go wants with me. my other $25 worth of dogs. You know I have $25 worth of dogs in my cart. I did not know. You will know. But I in a also second. know we've got a Halloween <gasps> owl. Oh my gosh. Here you go. Yes, please. I'm not done. Is this for me? Is this a I gift for me? I for oh, I was shopping for you too. Kind of. Wait, <laughs> we'll, get, we'll get to that. Look at this little bugger. Beautiful little crackle yes, glass. Yes, crackle piece. glass. Yes. Two dollar crackle glass. Piece. Crackle glass. Yes. Nice little piece. That is nice. No damage. Three dollars. Transfer where? Yes, this. Oh, I like that. That's a pretty, just, I love the colors. I, I know. Again, no damage. I've checked all of these little mm -hmm. leaf points. Now, there may be a mark under it, but it I'm not going like to fight is. with it. And it's 97 yeah. cents. Mm -hmm. So, this is going into my Etsy shop. Guess why? Because guess where we live? I thought I saw more of that somewhere on the shelves. I don't know. Um, I just thought I would grab a little piece like yes. this. Because people are very interested in that whole Pennsylvania yeah, oh, Dutch absolutely. thing. And here we are in the middle of Pennsylvania Dutch <laughs> country. I just feel like I saw more of it. Now I'm gonna have to go oh, back I'm and look. Go take a look. Then. Okay. I grabbed this because this is a wooden plate holder, mm -hmm. and as you know, I picked up some very nice yes. plates. And this is not well. It's vintage enough for Etsy. It's pre 2000, but it's not especially old. It's not especially interesting, but it's going to be especially useful going with a plate. Mm -hmm. Uh, this. Oh, I like that. This is just a nice handmade yes. piece. It's look. It's, I like what it. What is that? That's like a crane like a heron or a stork or a heron or yeah. it's something. And the nice grasses. Mm -hmm. and I, I love these mugs with the thumb rests. Yes. So it's a just. You know how I. And feel I like the crazing. Name. Personally, I like the crazing. Yes, on as do I. It's on the handle, I love it. And you can see the crazing right in here. And of course, the crazing I like it. Is just the glaze cooling yes. a little too quickly. So I like another that. indication of a handmade piece. Now this mm -hmm. is just a nice old, um, uh, uh, just a nice old pot. I have no idea how old. No, it's just a nice pot. I really like the glazing changes here. I so, like it. I like it as well. Um, it gets my approval. <laughs> A nice lusterware piece. Mm -hmm. It's dirty, and that's actual dirt. Ew, ew, yeah. ew! Now it's on your finger. Ew, ew, ew! I've got. <laughs> you have wipes. You have everything. But yeah, it's just a nice lusterware bowl. But it is dirty, and it needs to be cleaned. And it's a dollar. And I, this. I like the yellow roses. I do too, and I'm thinking that may well be one of my tidbit tray plates. Mm -hmm. I figured that's what you were thinking. That is... And the gold will bring it together because yes. the other pieces have gold. Yeah. I might not use it with the reticulated pieces. Mm -hmm. This might go for something different, but that yellow is striking. Mm -hmm. And this... It's vibrant. I like it. Well, if you look at, at where the, the center mm -hmm. pin will go, it'll be right about here, and it will obstruct none of the design. You'll mm -hmm. still see the roses. I think it could be very effective. So, very nice. Is what I got. Now I found see. this for you if you're interested. I didn't know if you would be. It's a nice little it has stickers. It's have to Japan. Um, Otagiri original. Mm -hmm. That's Otagiri. You are giving me Otagiri. I'm, gift I'm gifting you Otagiri. Oh my god. Okay, you must love it. <laughs> yes. They're not coffee mugs, they're tea. It doesn't matter. This is why, if they were coffee, darn straight, I would have kept them. But I love you enough to give you a tea set. <laughs> I'm so grateful. Those are beautiful. Oh my gosh, aren't they? Look how old those are. The strawberry, oh strawberry my plants. Word. Five dollars with a back mark. Out of out of the way, Starbucks. Move. Everybody has to sleep. <laughs> Stay there. Look at how old that is. Those are old. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. 
actually embossed right in the bottom. Beautiful. Yes, five dollars for the whole oh, stack. That. that is terrific. All right, so I got those. And now you've got a ten dollars. You oh. know. And you weren't kidding, you no, got a dozen no. dogs. I've got a ton of dogs on there. The oh. reason I'm getting this one is that one right there with the newspaper in his mouth. Uh huh. That is why I'm buying this $10 thing of dogs for the one with the newspaper. <laughs> that is. Call just... me crazy. No, I'm not going to call you crazy. That's it's okay. Funny. It's okay. I get that all the time. <laughs> yes, but not. But, but this one is worth $10 for all those dogs. Oh my goodness, yes. Look I mean, that's a lot of dogs for $10. Oh, yeah. You could sell those dogs for 50 cents a piece. And yeah, oh, absolutely. Oh. Yes, oh yes, my. it's what you think it is. Hey, <laughs> Look at you. I'm going to keep him. <laughs> I'm going to hang him. Yes, Bring from my porch. Yeah, like out of your other birds. Yes, absolutely. Oh. And I love how it's a cigarette, so the smoke would come out the top of the chimney. Oh my God. Isn't that so that, fun? Uh, oh Isn't my that God. so fun? Yes, it is. Look at that. And then you've got this cigarette. Yep, this, this is an ashtray as well. And the little dog yeah. is putting out the cigarette. The yeah. Oh, that is so, so cute. A Japan piece. Yes. So many fun this ashtrays is today. one of the reasons that we go for the Japan where people have asked about that. They are very nicely constructed. Some of them are just so cute and so, so clever. So clever. I'm right? really, that is just precious. <laughs> this, of course, is Delta. Now, that's just art glass. I believe it's, it's China. I don't think it's Murano. It's just sloppy. It's globby. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's, it's, you know, it's not Murano, but it's However, art glass. It has all of its fingers. Mm -hmm. It does, yes. No, it doesn't. Oh, no. Wait, yep, it doesn't. It's, yeah. Wait, huh? Right there. No! I love when we do cart inspections. Bye bye, little piece. Oh, look at this. Is this a golden retriever? I think it is. I think it's a spaniel, isn't it? Maybe not. Is it a golden retriever? I don't know. It could be. I don't know. It looks just like Laura, um, who was a golden retriever guide dog of a friend of mine. Laura it's is no possible. longer with us. It's possible. But it's, I like it. Uh, Laura it could be any dog you want it to be. I, yes. She's <laughs> the smartest dog I ever knew. These are beautiful. By Aren't the those way. fun? They're delft. Yes. I like. I love them. Love them. So let's see. What am I missing? What else? No, that's everything that you you gave me. I mean, that's oh, everything okay. I grabbed. So that's everything you've you seen. Got. You've seen everything. Right. You've done a thorough cart Fantastic. inspection. <laughs> Back to work. Chop chop. That's right. Focus. Okay. Well, the music is very loud, but I think we are going to end the video right here. We did actually better than I thought we were going to do today. I wasn't expecting a whole lot since we were just here like two days ago. But we still found like a ton of goodies. So we're gonna head out to the car and uh, we'll catch you on the wrap up. Okay, well that pretty much sums up our time at the Goodwill. I think we did pretty good. I wasn't I, expecting a whole lot. Oh yes, someone had been in earlier and told us there was nothing there. And I thought, really? We could usually <laughs> find something. And I think we actually did very, very well. I think well we in did, today. yeah. I was expecting it to be bare. But no, there, there were, were a, a lot of nice pieces. Yeah. Yes. And um, Jocelyn made out with the owls. I did, yes. And I got tons of dogs. I think I got oh, like my word, yes. $30 worth of dogs. Uh, but you, no, actually, I think you paid $30 for the dogs, but I think you got about $80 worth yes, of dogs easily. Yes, I did. Easily. <laughs> and that's not even counting the ones that are going to go to Basset Hound Rescue. That's right. I don't even so, know how many Bassets are in there, but we'll sneak well, yes. through them. So, anyway. All right, so this yeah. was actually a very good haul. It was, yeah, and we'll be talking about everything we got, what we paid for it, and what we think we can get for it on eBay tomorrow um, in the right. haul video. So... So yeah. we'll see you all next. Well, I will see you yes. next week. Jocelyn is going I to see, see you tomorrow. You tomorrow. All right, all right later. see you later. And while we are at the Goodwill, Jocelyn, um, uh, Jocelyn's Basset Hound Lady, the lady she gets the Basset Hounds for on Basset Hound Rescue. What's the name of it? Basset um, Hound Rescue. Well, she actually she raises. She does the auctions. For multiple Basset Hound rescues. So okay. she chooses a rescue and she, she does is a our Basset yes. Hound rescue lady. Our Basset Hound rescue lady. She got in touch with Jocelyn and said, take a look at this article about a goodwill in what was it? Land of Land Lincoln of, Land of is Lincoln. the region. 
uh, and that's Illinois. Illinois. About their goodwills. Now I'm gonna let Jocelyn tell you. It's because so, she's gonna become polite. Oh yes, polite. Um, so what they had, what they were going to do in Land of Lincoln for their goodwills is they were going to cut the pay of their disabled workers. Like to nothing. To like, nothing. Literally, you don't get to work here anymore. <laughs> you, yeah, yeah. They were gonna cut the pay of their disabled workers, and because of public social media outcry and by the <laughs> way we are social media and we are out we are out crying they have uh reversed this decision but i feel like it still needs to be called out and there still needs to oh, be yeah. attention because the fact that they had even considered it really makes me upset because goodwill's entire raison d'etre is to help people <laughs> with disability yeah i'm sorry see all right I'm no 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 you you're good you are fine we are both really upset about this but i want everybody to realize that the uh, the reaction is not to boycott Goodwill's period because every region is different so you know we go picking we're about to go into Goodwill here this is the Keystone area of Goodwill and they have a very strong stance on helping the disabled and job training and you know they are very good about it the Goodwills in New England were the same way they were very dedicated but apparently in Land, Land of Lincoln, Lincoln. Illinois, <laughs> they have decided they have a different focus and their entire raison d'etre is to, I don't know, uh, cut the pay of the people with disabilities so they can in fact pay people without disabilities because six or seven years from now the minimum wage is going to go up. Six or seven yes, years from now. It's bizarre. This was beyond inappropriate. Uh, the CEO of that Goodwill, Sharon Durbin. Sharon Durbin, remember that name? <laughs> Sharon Durbin, because, we're calling you out. <laughs> yeah, because if you don't play your cards right, you're going to be meeting Sharon Durbin in hell. This is a woman who was, that was a condescending and supercilious in everything she said about the people with disabilities mm -hmm. that they are supposed to be helping through job training and employment services. And mind you, these are people who are getting subsidized employment to begin with. Yes. So they are getting the services of these people for almost nothing because they're a job training program mm -hmm. and not legitimately an employer. That's and exactly still, it's right. like, we're just going to shove them aside. And of course, meanwhile, she is saying, well, my brother has a disability. But sometimes these people, you know, they just, they're not as efficient. And no, this was so far beyond inappropriate that even an employer whose job was not to support people with disabilities would have been considered outrageous for the statement she made. So, yes, we're very upset about this. We're, I was really upset when I... When I Go first online. read the article, and then <laughs> I was planning on venting about it today, and I went online yesterday, and they're like, after public outcry, they're reversing the decision. No. It's not because of public, like, you can't. That what Jocelyn's point was when she said it to me is, how bad is it that you don't even realize what you've done wrong until, until the public outcries? You on like, it. <laughs> it's just, it's. You need the public to tell you that your decision was wrong? All right. That's it. All right. All right, all right. I'm We're sorry. now going into the Goodwill. Yes, we are. Okay. Of and the I'm, Keystone area Goodwill. Where they where, are actually doing what they're supposed to do. And they're helping the disabled. And we are going in here. We're going to purchase items where the profit goes to job training for disabled exactly. workers. And so we're going to go. Can, no, now I can smile and be happy because we we're doing something worthwhile. We can smile and be happy worthwhile. because we're doing something All right, thank worthwhile. you for indulging the rant. <laughs> all right, we'll catch you guys in a bit. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and if you've spotted something that you just can't live without, don't worry. I've put a link to our Etsy store down in the description.